Hey guys, welcome to another video feature of Soccer Perspectives. In today's session, we're going to be focusing on a very difficult topic. It is a three-phase play leading up to a combination shot on goal. So it is combination play and finishing. And this takes place in three specific ways sequentially. But before we get to the nitty gritty, let's please subscribe to my channel on Biso Tenen Kosi at Instagram. You can also find me on Sitem Biso Nkosi on YouTube. And my personal Gmail account is Biso Tenen Kosi at gmail.com. So, how does this attack game work? What takes place is that it's a three phase attack. The first attack happens in the middle where the two midfield players need to pass between each other. Then the striker needs to peel off away from the defenders and receive a through ball. The striker can take a first time shot or he can take a first touch and then shoot. After taking a shot, the midfield player that was doing the combination, one goes into the middle of the field and receives the ball from a wide area. And from the ball from a wide area, he can either link up play with the wide midfielder through uh, wing play and crossing, or he can open up his body and take a shot first time. Then the ball will come from the opposite wing, whereby the midfield player will dribble down the line, and from the dribble down the line, he'll then cross it into the player, into the box for the three players that are in the box. The three players in the box need to run front post, back post, and 45, which is the penalty mark area, to receive the cross. And that is how the functional drill works of a three-phase attack and uh, combination play leading to finishing. It's a great drill for teaching awareness and ensuring that young players and even old players will react accordingly to the match situation. I would start this drill from under 15 up. 